Good afternoon, or I should say good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to my picture, You Just Cast Together. I'm your host of sorts called Dr. Gaze101. Today we do a sample gameplay of Vanquish. Uh, it's from a game from about over 10 years ago. I have good things about the game. Kind of have a time crisis like feeling because the graphics and all look similar. So enjoy the show. Please thumbs up, subscribe, and share. Donate to my Patreon if you can at DrGaze101. If you cannot donate, just share my videos. That's all you can do for me, really. If you cannot do anything else, just share my videos. Uh, if you watch at least a good five minutes of it, that would be great. You know, understand where I come from. I do talk from time to time, but not all the time. I will admit that. So, uh, especially these past couple of years, uh, I used to say that um, I, I've been busy with other things in my life, with school and all, so that kind of subverted a little my attention towards other things. But this is the time this week to do so, to do a video every day for the next few days. Because currently, I'm on, I'm on vacation for my school, for my, school, my online school. So, take a break from that, and then play some more games with you guys, right? Alright guys, enjoy the show. Ah, I got seizure warnings. Great. Vanquish. Vanquish. Looking good. The scenery's a little bland, though. All right. Let's proceed with functionality testing. We're starting with electro-optical targeting systems calibration. Sam, I'm going to display a virtual target. Try to follow it visually. I'm so used to inverted controls, guys, so... If things seem backwards, let me know, and I'll adjust the optical nerve sensors. You know, this is a real pain in the ass. How many times you guys gonna make me do this? It's important we have baselines, Gideon. Just because you can read a manual doesn't mean you know what you're doing. So let's do something different. What's on today's test schedule? Look, I know you're in a rush to get to the bar, but we've got a lot to go over. To the bar. <laughs> full control to you now. Go ahead and give us some basic rotational movement readings. It's like years of war. <laughs> okay. Alright. Skeletal actuators functioning nominally. We're going to get readings on boost limitation. Engage whenever you want. Output on our current reactor design. 
The suit's cooling system can't keep up with that output level. It's causing some temporary performance loss, especially in the skeletal actuators. I'm losing like 30% mobility here. 30% is within our project goals. Elena, let's move on before Frank reads us the Project Grant chapter and verse. <laughs> <laughs> Firing systems. Proceed with test. Affirmative. Launching virtual target. We're going to adjust target acquisition. are on and functioning normally. You can't suppress the recoil anymore? <sighs> Sam, your weapon isn't exactly stock. I know. I'm changing blade modes. Let's try firing something different. I really need to teach the inverted controls, guys. This is not good, kind of for me. We're still working on expanding the number of configurations stored in memory. Hey, you can't just scan whatever you want and have it work. That being said, go ahead and activate the scanner. Nice. Acquiring upper will, will upgrade your current weapon if you have the, the blade system increase its effectiveness in various ways. Okay. If you have the same weapon when already carrying the, the best run of ammunition will allow you to proceed to the, to the upgraded path of that weapon. This thing is even picking up surface scratches. Blade can only replicate what already exists, even the imperfections. Now we're going to check the grenade mounts. Oh, for a grenade, right, I'm sorry. I was thinking about something else. Alright, how to do this shit. EMP emitter will temporarily disable its target for movement for a little bit of period of time. Alright.
This is affecting as large groups of enemies or do hide behind cover. That's good. Alright, close quarters. We need to get some data on how far we can push the actuators. I'm releasing an object to test your impact force. Our friends at the Pentagon were happy to lend us a brand new piece of equipment. Electromagnetic armor. Punch it as much as you'd like, Sam. Confirming electromagnetic reaction. Sam, give the electromagnetic engine generating the reaction force a second to cool. So we can't hit the thing too quick, huh? Go ahead and punch it again. Nothing beats the old one, too. <laughs> Looks like you've still got some fight in you, Sam. Nice. There's a plunge! <laughs> Love it. Love it indeed. Attacks depend on currently equipped weapon. Each has own merits. So, exper so experiments will find those best suitable to the situation. Sam, we took the measurements we made of your brain's sympathetic nervous system and tuned the R's suit synaptic emitters to augment your reactions in the fire. Doesn't really make walking around with electrodes all day any more comfortable. Small price to pay for having elevated synaptic activity during critical fight or flight situations. Will you two quit bickering like a couple of MIT grad students? Now let's proceed with our test of the R's functionality. Let me know when you're ready, Sam. Okay. Take her sort of trigger your air bomb until you soup or the heat's like you to least react to any bit danger. I finished implementing the manual trigger system you asked for. The system will automatically lock if it detects any life-threatening imbalances in your hormonal levels due to extended use. AR mobile lines will intercept attacks, such as missiles. However, like boost, the boost mobile will overheal your suit, so use it wisely. Alright. What day at DARPA? <laughs> Pretty cool, right? Very well. I think that's enough for today's test. Good job, Sam. That little workout Say 15 minutes, it's not bad.
laser satellite. Great. Oh shit! You blew up, damn, bro. Hmm. Up, bros. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> the golden game where it's just been like certain the oldest people shit dude. The United States. My fellow Americans, today has been a day Madam of President, great huh? San Francisco will never be the same, and the toll of our war has increased by countless men, women, and children. Their loss is deeply felt by every American. To those who have committed this heinous act, we say firmly, we will not negotiate with those who wish to destroy us. Our strength is unmatched. Our will resolute. We will be victorious. God yeah. bless you all. Victorious. God bless the United States. Power to the people. <laughs> That's so 1990s right there. <laughs> you don't see that today's world. That power to the people and shit like that. It's subverted and shit. That's a political commentator for another channel. Oh yeah. This is Sam. DARPA sent him to come along with us. Man, we've got eight hours to stop New York from becoming the next San Francisco. Make no mistake. We will stop that from happening. Operatives take their orders directly from POTUS and SECDEF. These guys are just interested in marking their territory. Sam, remember why we're here. These guys look so real. My goodness, they Xbox 360, right? That cigarette, huh? Do we ever forget? That's the place. I just, I just smoke my weed as well, right? But like, yo, shit, that stuff is so good. <laughs> yeah, boy. Ooh. <laughs> Unfortunately, that's not me, of course. So, 
<laughs> Body be scratched. You did get some training in this thing, right? Our simulators are very thorough. They did quite a number on you, huh? We could use you as a test subject at DARPA. To this shit. First things first, you check out the uh, options of controls. Sorry for the wait, guys. Push on, no, 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 Just want to save that long, huh? Alright guys, let's do this shit. It's like time crisis. That's what I want to know. Why did they get this part where I just like they do this make was like some of the time crisis? Cause the action or something of that sort at first, right? You know? Well there's no countdown where you fight people. So where are you in situation from, right? <laughs> that was a close one. Move it, move it, move it! Slap, 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 slap! Forever. Wait, 
watch the sequences here. What's going on here? Oh, it's been like, what, five minutes? Not even, uh, ten? Holy shit. <laughs> Watching a movie here, this is pretty cool. Now, this is what I'm talking about. Let's get my Namco. I, I would be definitely be grateful to have Namco with the figure this game. What do I know about the matter? To our mission too. We aren't gonna get through it like this, sir. Yeah. If you go there, you should be able to flank the enemy from behind. Damn! Are we here or we're not of ammo? Yeah. Holy shit! Coming down. Holy shit. God damn! Holy shit! Damn, bro! Put it all last of it. Go, go, go! 
little fuckers! <laughs> The Xbox decision game, that's for certain. Alright guys. This is a big game. I'm gonna play more of it. After I call it quits, so I do something every day for you guys for 30 minutes or, or less. Sometimes I might do 45 feet an hour, depends on how the game is. This game is alright to play, is that I have the beginning of these controls, and I want to make you guys wait through all that time to make sure that I match the controls. So please thumbs up, subscribe, and share. If you can, donate, that's fine. Everything's down below the description box. And I'll see you tomorrow, hopefully. Alright, guys, see you around. Bye.